It's not RC. Adventures in Radio Control. Radio Control. <laughs> So you can see I had a small issue with my wing here. Um, yeah, it folded up on me in mid-flight. Uh, you just went right over like that. Cracked uh, right in half. The uh, plane came spiraling down, wasn't much I could do. So, But luckily, I mean, luckily most of the damage is just to the wing. Uh, the fuselage actually survived pretty good. Um, as you can see, it broke right about here, which incidentally is right where my carbon fiber spars end, right about here. So that's where she just folded up. Um, so, nothing wrong with my uh, joint design, it's uh, my spar is the issue here. Um, I use spruce and, uh, you know, did shear webbing on, uh, you know, just standard normal construction. Um, had um, sheeting on both top and bottom of this section and, uh, you know, it should have been plenty strong. So, uh, yeah, I think I've got to rethink the uh, spruce bars for a wing of this type. So. Um, yeah, so I wanted to do a little testing here, a um, little strength test, and uh, my idea here was I was just going to try to see what's involved in breaking this other half here, because obviously I've got no use for it, can't repair this now, so now I'm going to see just how strong this is, and uh, just get a feel for, um, you know, just how tough this, this uh, construction was, so, uh, so um, I'm just going to break it over my knee here and uh, see what's involved in that, so here we go. Hmm. Yeah, that made a really unpleasant noise. Um, yeah, I can't say that took a lot of effort to do that. It's interesting it broke more or less where the other one did. Well, a little bit off to the side. I put my knee in the middle, so I guess that kind of decided where it was going to bend, but a uh, break. But um, yeah, not a super strong wing this one. Uh, as I said, my joints, my center section, and my where I joined the wings together are great. They had carbon fiber in there. And, They've held up real good. Um, right past the carbon fiber, that was a problem. Well, actually, let's see what happens there. Uh, I try to break the center section, which has the carbon fiber in it. See how strong that is. Oh. Yeah, that's. Yeah. I actually can't break that. That's really impressive. That is one solid center section there. Carbon fiber really is as good as they say. I can't break that. That's wow. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm going to do for my next wing, though. Is uh, I'm going to do carbon fiber all the way down the whole span. You know, forget about this spruce nonsense. Uh, it's modern ages. It's 2012. Uh, yeah, time to move up and uh, use some modern uh, technology. Anyway, um, yeah, that's that. So anyway, um, enough about wing design. Uh, you guys probably want to see the crash footage. Yeah, sorry, I don't actually have any uh, real footage of that, but I have the next best thing. Um, yeah, I went ahead and tried to simulate pretty much what happened on my flight simulator here. Um, this is a pretty accurate model of, uh, of my glider. And uh, yeah, I was just tooling along, doing some lazy thermaling. Uh, it was probably the third or fourth flight that day. Didn't have any problems. And then all of a sudden, snap! Uh, yep, she just folded right over and uh, started spinning on down and there wasn't a whole lot I could do. You know, I tried messing with the ailerons, the elevator, rudder, I tried everything and uh, she was going in. No stopping it, so she just came down and down and down. It was about a thousand feet up, went straight in and that was the end of that. Anyway, thought you might enjoy that. Uh, yep, that's all for today. Thanks for watching.